Well, downtown El Paso business is raising concerns over an increase in migrants along El Paso streets in the evenings. Welcome to KTSM 9 News at 5. I'm Stephanie Shields. As we've reported, migrants have been seen spread out downtown and KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live from downtown. Now, Shelby, what are store owners saying? Stephanie, shop owners down here tell me that they're actually closing up early, some having their employees leave it together, saying that those concerns are due to the number of migrants that are actually staying and sleeping in the downtown area. So you can see that it's not a super well lit area. The owner of one store says she has to walk to a back alleyway when arriving and leaving work, saying that migrants sleep back there, leaving behind cardboard during the day, saying one day when she arrived, migrants had a fire going in the alleyway, showing us a burned trash can lid. Another store owner says their employees have brought up concerns over closing up shop late at night recently. I started closing early now because, you know, as soon as it starts to get dark, like, my employees don't feel safe walking by themselves. Coming to, to open my shop, and this is the middle of the day or early morning, and the gentleman, well, there was like maybe seven, eight of them on the corner, just instead of the usual cat calls, they started even purring. The El Paso Police Department says they understand there might be some concerns among business owners. Sending a statement, reading in part, quote, our department is also increasing patrols to ensure a visible law enforcement present. So we encourage open communication between our department and the community. The El Paso Police Department also suggests that business owners here in downtown also put up surveillance cameras and report any suspicious activity and increase the lighting as well. Stephanie.